What's up? My name is Technoba here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll be showing you how to get an FPS counter slash overlay in Halo Infinite. There's multiple ways to do it, so let's go ahead and begin. The absolute simplest, if you own the game on Steam, is to fire it up, then hit shift and tab, click settings at the very bottom, and inside of here, on the in-game tab, simply make sure that FPS counter is turned to top left, right, bottom right, or bottom left, depending on where you'd like to see it, and turn on high contrast color to make it green. Upon doing so, you can click OK, and you'll have an FPS counter showing in the corner of your screen. Pretty nice. But of course, there is one built into the actual game itself. I'll hit F1 to bring up the options, or click the options button in the bottom right, head across to settings, and then click UI. Inside of here, under heads up display, we'll be scrolling down to just before outlines and colors, where you see these colored boxes here, and we're looking for FPS counter and network statistics. These will pop up in the top right hand corner and give you plus minus the same numbers as the Steam one over here, though of course this works on any platform you'd like. This is especially important to find out what kind of server you're playing on, and of course to find out what kind of FPS you're getting, which could tell you how your optimization has worked so far. Speaking of optimization, there's an optimization guide linked in the description down below that I'd highly recommend you check out. But anyways, that's about it for this quick video. Thank you all for watching. My name's been taken over here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.